What's up, everyone? Matthew K. Hafey here from Trivium Ibaraki, Matthew K. Hafey Twitch, all the stuff. Uh, today I got home from tour. Um, everyone that was on our first stream saw me. I fired everything up and I was like, oh, wait, I'm missing an integral piece of my gear to make my amp head to the capture thing, to the computer all work. There's, there's a lot of steps, a lot of stuff, and I didn't think I can stream. Luckily, I remembered my good buddy, Jens Bogren, just sent me the new amp knob. What the heck is the amp knob? In a world of suites and VSTs and all the things, there are so many damn choices. There's this company, that company, this guy's signature thing, that guy's signature thing. It's like, what the hell do I use? It's it's become just as difficult it is as like picking out the amp and the cab and the pedal. And as are you doing cab sim? Are you doing something like a box of doom? Are you doing like which thing are you doing? Jens went the opposite direction, which is typically the method I like to do, and that's why I love Jens so much. Jens is one of the best metal producers, mixers in the world, and he created this thing called Amp Knob. I was like, what is Amp Knob? He's like, it is one knob, that's it. <laughs> so I couldn't use my main rig, and I downloaded an Amp Knob. I was like, all right, here we go. He's gonna have a bunch of steps and serial stuff and all stuff. It was super easy to download because I don't like the steps. And once you have it armed on your DI track, here's my DI. It's left side because it's stereo. You could do stereo or mono. Um, I wanted to do stereo this morning to make it sound good. So it's got a switch to on, and then it has a knob, and the tone is already great. So you turn the knob to the gain you want, and it has fantastic tone straight at the gate. So let me show you without my mic. Pretty insane, right? It's one knob, the tone rules. Obviously you can put stuff before, you can put stuff after. This is nothing, this is just the amp knob. There's no EQ cuts, there's no EQ in front of it, there's no overdrive in front of it. You could put all that stuff in it. Hell, you could put our pedal in front of it if you wanted to. You could put nothing in front of it. I sang to this, I played to it, it was freaking awesome. Even while singing and playing, there's no latency, which is super important for me. Time will not heal. Lord, love me your pain I cannot wait For it all to come class And tell your face Ripping your veins out Your insides burn And kill you from within See? Crazy. Crazy. So latency is perfect, um, which normally there's a severe latency for a lot of these suites that I've experienced, especially for live streaming. I think it's more of like maybe a studio thing, but the latency is awesome and it's on or off and it's gain up or down. So Jens Bogren, Bogren Digital, well fricking done on the amp knob. I absolutely love it. <laughs> 